What is considered an alcoholic relapse? It's incredibly satisfying to finally achieve sobriety after a long and difficult recovery process. However, the fear of relapsing can follow us at times. It can be devastating to consider that your sobriety may not last indefinitely after you have won that hard-fought battle. However, it is quite common to relapse after you have been clean for a while. Relapse is so common that it's often considered a part of long-term recovery. After a year of sobriety, a person may choose to smoke marijuana to relieve stress or have a glass of wine with friends because they feel they can handle it without going overboard, which is an example of a light relapse. There is emotional, mental, and physical relapse. During an emotional relapse, a person's ability to cope with their emotions healthily may deteriorate. Instead, they may bottle up their emotions, isolate themselves from others, deny the existence of their problems, and neglect self-care. While mental relapse can also include glorifying past drug use, minimizing the negative consequences of using, and seeking out opportunities to get high. The physical relapse stage is when you use drugs or alcohol for the first time and eventually lead to a full-blown relapse. It is very important to seek help if you feel like relapsing. There are aftercare plans that will continue to look after you even after treatment. Call us today and we will guide you to the best treatment programs that will undoubtedly give you a long life of sobriety. Does someone you love suffer from drug addiction? Don't wait until it's too late. Call our 24-7 helpline at 1-800-570-2259. A caring addiction specialist is awaiting your call.